Hi uh, guys, I have made some web mining logic. One of them is simple uh, string lookups. You're looking for substrings. The other one is just a helper class that has a couple useful methods in it. The first one, the web mining class, is very useful for data mining. Of course, uh, I built it for data mining on websites that I needed to interface with that did not have an interface. And this form here is just a demonstration of that web, mi web mining class. So you uh, type an address up in the top here, hit download page, and the page is displayed here so I can show you how the program actually moves through the lines. My look around term is Alexa. We're going to look around this term for the actual search term. And the search term is alternate. Usually you would use a, an elaborate regular expression value for both of these terms here. But for the sake of the video, I'm not going to do that. And the, lo the looking radius is how far around the word Alexa do we want to look for the word alternate. So uh, you specify a looking direction. So up would mean that I'm looking seven lines above the word Alexa. Well, no more than seven for the word alternate. Down. Uh, be looking below the word Alexa and both I would be looking both up and down. Okay, so let's take a look at it. Okay, so it's looking for the term Alexa. So Alexa was found a bit earlier up here, right here, and then when it went down less than seven lines and found alternate. And I have simple search term logic over to the right. It just goes line by line looking for a uh, regular expression match. My methods yield a match object so it's really easy to work with the results. Okay so I'm gonna look at my helpers here and this image downloader looks for or it downloads images to memory as an image object. And it's just a single method. And I have an, another single method that checks for the robot. So let's check the robot on the pink bike here. So HTTP www.pinkbike.com. This has a robot. Very good. So I'm going to upload this to my site. I may not be able to upload the entire project because of Webly's uh, or Weebly's bandwidth restrictions now. So they, they're restricting you with your uploads now, so that you'll buy or pay for a pro version of your site. Of the yeah, and um, I'll just upload the class and the instructions. In, in that case, it's very important to read the instructions for this. Uh, uh, web mining utility so that you know how to use it and you must use it as your at your own risk and make sure that you uh, download and read the robots.txt file and follow the robot rules. Let's take a look at that uh, one of them real quick. So pinkbike.com is going to have one and basically it tells what robots can do what. 